Hey, it's the all new crew show. <laughs> yes, it is. Power yes. 106. Yes, Power 106, baby. Is this going guy down. is legendary, man. And, and we have new music from Jamie oh, Foxx. Jamie Foxx is on with us. Oh, He's here, man. man. And I still get nervous when I play. When I, I'm like a starving really? artist when it comes to music. I'm nervous. Like, oh, that's so good. I, I get worried because I always wanted to do music and I wanted to be real. Of and course. I and and it's, been a, it's been a hell of a journey. Yeah. And, and, and like, I wasn't in the music business at first. I was a comedian. You were a comedian. Right. I was sure, doing sure, all comedy. But you were doing music when you were in Living Color, like when nobody was watching, right? Was watching or listening, thing. right? Or listening, watch this. <laughs> so, I'm I did this character called Wanda, great Wanda character, Living Color. classic hey, character, for real though, mm. right? <laughs> and like, it was I was just starting to do it, but. Teddy Riley and Guy come to guest on A Living Color. Oh, wow. Here's my chance. Shout out to Blackstreet, by you the way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Black- oh, snap! <laughs> <laughs> Cabbage patch. So, <laughs> so, remember that? So, so, so I said, oh, Teddy Riley here? This is going to give me a chance to, to show him my music. Yeah. But I'm dressed as the girl character. Right. Oh, great. So oh. I go grab my wow. cassette. That's right. right. That's right. Throwback. All you kids, <laughs> Google it. Yeah. So I'm running with my cassette bearing down because he's leaving. And of I'm course. running with the fake titty the whole night. <laughs> oh my running God. towards Teddy Riley. You're in a dress. In by a the dress. Way. Yeah. In Sick heels. Heels. <laughs> which is crazy what you had to do for money at the time. So <laughs> I'm running and Teddy Riley looks back and knowing not knowing the character, he looks back and sees me coming. Right. And he's like, What I said, hey, <laughs> Teddy, listen, man, I want you to listen to my music, man. I do music. He goes, yeah. impossible. Oh, no. <laughs> I said, why are you? Nah, come on, baby. Please. Damn. On. You in the dress. Because he, he thought it was, a, it was like some joke. joke. Yeah, yeah, Come yeah, on, get yeah. out of here. And, the bodyguard, like, the and then the bodyguards didn't charge me, but, you know, they kind of give you the Brussels. You know, like, yeah, you know, yeah. like move here. along. Yeah, move along. I was like, damn. So I'm walking like the the, the uh, Incredible Hulk theme is playing as I'm walking back to my to my. Dr- <laughs> he knows that. He knows that. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but I was like, I ain't gonna get into music. Yeah. So what I did was not knowing that it would have ever happened this way. I put a studio in my house in Tarzana. The reason I did that, I would throw parties and then invite people that were musical to my party and Good get, move. get 16 get bars here. Good move. I get Snoop. Give me 16. Give me 24. Yeah. And they were a fan of yours yeah. from In Living Colors, so yeah. they so were they into would it. do it. So, and then I would throw these parties, like me and Dave would throw these parties where it would be crazy, like, swear to God, John B. on the piano. Damn. Wow. Mystical, singing to his song as John B. plays Unplugged. Uh-huh. That's that's one party. One the, the, the big signature party was Puff. This puff, right? So I'm throwing a party at my house. Two hundred people. The girls are very beautiful, but not loose, but not stuck up. Right in the middle. Right in the middle. You know what I'm saying? Right in the middle. Nobody too tight. It's great. We celebrating puff. And at that party, there was a guy standing on the wall. He had a green jumpsuit on. Nobody knew who he was. His name was Jay Z. Wow. Right. Standing on the wall. On the wall. Okay, yeah. and then <laughs> holding the wall up. Hold on, and then the other room was reserved for Missy Elliott. She's wow. hot. Wow. Yeah. Uh, and as I'm going to my garage to pick up some drinks, whatever, there's two guys, one tall, one a little shorter. Mm-hmm. The shorter one goes, "Yo, B, it's like this all the time, B. Like girls and things." I said, "Yeah, yeah, it's, it's cool. Who are you? Oh, we're the Neptunes. My, my name is no, Pharrell. Pharrell. Wow. Wow. What? Yeah. So it's one party. So, so all these different parties and I'm getting music from everybody, right? And then finally I throw this party and a kid walks in, backpack on, jaw a little swollen. Who is it? Kanye, Kanye West. Kanye, Kanye West. Wow. At my house party, Breon brings him to me. Breon Prescott, who's my music guy. And this was a different Kanye this at is the different, time. Different way. Listen, nobody knows him. Right. Yeah. Nobody knows this guy. I said, who that dude right there? They say, that's that new dude, Kanye. He produced beats for Jay-Z, whatever. Yeah. I said, oh, he performs? I said, yeah. We have a thing in my house, and so we've been doing it. We call it On My Balcony, and we call it New Artist Hour. That means anybody that's at my party can perform. Oh, no dope. one's allowed to boo or anything like that. Dope. We've had everybody. Yes. I've done it for, for, for everybody. I've had Ed Sheeran sleep on my uh, couch for six weeks, and what? the list goes on. I'll get to that. <laughs> that's okay. dope. So, my man, there he so, is. So, so pack, backpack. That, I, said, yo, I said, yo, they say you rap, man. This dude do a freestyle that kills everything. Oh, it was man. good. I said, oh, my God. You, you're incredible. I said, how come you're not doing music? Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm, I'm trying to. Uh, I, 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 I got a song for you. I said, for me? I said, what you, what you mean? He said, I got a song for you. I know you've been trying to sing. I see you on TV, whatever. I said, well, I got a studio in the back. What? So we go in the back. 
So we're in the studio. He says the song go like this. She says she wants some Marvin Gaye, some the Luther, Luther Vandross, a little. I say I got it, oh Kanye. Who doesn't anybody know yet? <laughs> right, I right, got right, it. Right, right, Let right, me right. perfect what you're singing. Uh -huh. She yeah. say she wants some. Uh, I'm doing all oh, you R&B uh, stuff. You went show tune on him though, kind this, of. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm old. I didn't know that it was hip hop. And he and you know he was Kanye. He went, uh, uh, don't do that. <laughs> wow. That's terrible. So he had that swag I, back then. I, I said, I said, well, why? He said, I said, but you know, I got to put the thing on. You got to put. He said, uh, it's hip hop. Just, just, just follow me. So in my mind, I'm thinking, <laughs> I'm thinking, this song is whack. <laughs> He's never going to make it. It's a fail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a get this guy out of my house. Get him out. Right? I do the song no anyway. Nobody knows him. You know what I mean? I do the song anyway. I leave. I do a bad movie for six weeks. I come back. <laughs> What the, movie was it? By it the way? was Stealth. Ooh. Oh, I, I know. That. You're Terrible. right. You're sorry. right. <laughs> Terrible. Sorry. It happens. Help so me, Cruz. Come on, man. Swap for the blow. I apologize. So, <laughs> let it go. Let it go. So, so I come back and they say, "You remember that song you said was what? It's number one." And that's how I got into music. So we did that number one. And then once we did that number one, we go on to do Ray Charles. Ray Charles comes out. Crazy. Ray Charles, we do the whole Oscar thing. But then go my dinner. boy Breon calls me and says, yo, you want, Breon always says everything three times. You want to be in the record business? What? You want to be in the record business? Dude, you want to be in the record business? <laughs> I, I love friends like, like, yeah. like that, yo, by yeah, the way. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's great. He says, get your ass up. Get up. Get up. I said, what? It's three in the morning. Sure. You got to get down here. Kanye's working on this song. You got to hear it. I walk in and you hear thunks, 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 thunks. I ain't saying she a gold digger. What? And I'm like, oh, snap. Breon tells me, when we walk in, once we get into the studio, follow my lead. Everybody's jamming to the club. Vibing right? Yeah. Vibing, right? Yeah. Breon turns it off. That's whack. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> and everybody's like, what? He said, that's whack. Unless you put my boy on it, it's whack. You say, and he said, go in the booth, Fox. I said, what you doing? Show him what you do. Go, go, so we go in the booth, right? And he takes over the studio, says, all right, all right, Fox, give me something. And I'm like, uh, all right, uh, run the track back. All right, okay. Okay, run it back. Okay, run it back. Okay, run it, run it, run it back. And if I, I think I got it. She take my money when I'm in lead. Yes, yeah, she's a trifling friend indeed. Oh, she's a gold digger. Way over town that digs on do 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 and the rest wow. is just wow. wow. Is it crazy? That is wow. amazing. Wow. Hey, standing on everybody. Standing on. Oh. So that's so that's how I'm. But like Golden, I said, wow. I was. I'm glad wow. that I got a chance to meet Kanye, meet people that could take me from the funniness, yeah, of course, and make real records. Yes. So I won't. So I'm not joking with it. Last part of the story. <laughs> we're doing an album. It's three in the morning again. Breon says, <coughs> "Yo." You want to be in the record business? You want to be in the record business? <laughs> Do you want to be in the record business? <laughs> Three times. Uh -oh. so, All right. So Crystal B got Jamie Foxx sick. No. I'm saying, man. Wait, go. No, he didn't. <laughs> so we get down to the studio. He plays this song called yeah. Blame It on the Alcohol. Oh, there it is. First oh, yes. listen. Out of here, bro. I say, I stop it. I said, Money, look me in the eye right now and tell me that's my song. He said, it's your song, but you got to cut it tonight because I was at a listening thing. Yeah. They didn't really understand it. I grabbed it. It's right. ours. We got to cut it. So we stayed up all night. We did it. And then the rest is history. Was going out of tune your, your choice or were you exactly, not with that? Exactly my choice because here was the thing. Had I done it Brian McVandros style. Right. <laughs> right, 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 right. It wouldn't have worked. It wouldn't have worked. Yeah, you're right. And out of tune was very hot at the moment. It wouldn't have worked. And I said, it needs to be the record exactly how it's done and I don't want nobody to know it's me until they finally find out about it. And that's how that's how we ran with it. Love that. Crazy. Let's get into new Jamie Foxx music yeah. right now. This is called You Changed Me featuring yeah. C. Breezy, Chris yeah, Brown. Chris Brown. Damn. Yeah, that's, that's, that's my little brother. And a lot of people don't know, Chris Brown, the behind the scene Chris Brown that I know, okay. not the one that everybody gets a chance to... You know, it's tough. In other words, it's tough living in the social media. And, in the, and you know, course, back yeah. in the day, if Internet. it had been around, I never would have made it. Right. With everything I did 20 years ago, I hear you. Was, <laughs> but listen, I've been gone. But you got famous the hard way. Yeah. The yeah. long way. The the, but, but, here, but here's the thing, though. These young guys now, sure, it's too much. It's too many to get, too many, too many camera phones. Too Distraction. Many, yeah. the things and like, so I know Chris Breezy, when he comes to my crib and he can't go out because... Things are so tough on him. And mm -hmm. him and all his boys come. And my sister, who has Down said, you know, De DeAndre, loves Chris Brown. Oh, it's very for sweet. For the past, I don't know how many years, he always comes, always hugs and gives us kids. That's so that's so why dope. this song, sweet. this song, 
not only I think it's, it's a dope song, but it, he's a dope dude. Is he is is he so comfortable at your house that he could walk in and go straight to the refrigerator and you're okay yeah. with that? Yeah, he's it's that. But, yeah. but I mean, they, I mean, they really come and chill though, and and, and that's for all the young dudes. Yeah. I let them all know because. I said, look. I said, when they when they take a picture of this and it goes, it, you can't we you can't it, stop it. Can't maintain you can, it. You yeah, can, yeah, yeah. It, it helps you, but when it falls on you, it is is terrible. I wouldn't yeah. know what to do. That's like, right. Me and Dave, I've done things that if they had taken a picture of it, I wouldn't be able to live in the United States. <laughs> <laughs> they would have kicked you out. Yo, where Fox at, man? Yo, he's in Laos. <laughs> <laughs> You went to Mexico. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you changed me featuring yeah. Chris Brown. This is Jamie Foxx yes. on the all new cruise yeah. show. The world famous Mickey Ficky Mix Power 106. Better now. Get yourself a pair at Robert Wayne Footwear.